Hello guys, Rad here from Rad Pizarot and I do want to let you know that the extended monthly reading which focus in depth into a career and uh, relationship life for the representative side uh, sign are now available for just as little as uh, one dollar. So if you want to um, if you want to go more in depth for your star sign and you like my readings in the way I read, you can uh, purchase these extended videos on my website, uh, either going there uh, from your browser or uh, just, you know, visiting the link that is displayed down below in the description of this video. And uh, <clears throat> that way you can purchase those videos. So it's like getting a, a two additional readings to the general reading of the month which is totally free the general one and it is on my youtube channel and um, for those who are more prone you know to know everything they can purchase for just three dollars their sun moon and ascendant sign and that way they are gonna have six reading to kind of like piece together and to and to obtain the biggest picture ever for what is yet to come for them into this representative month and the price is that low because I want to show you um, my appreciation for your loyalty and support. And in case you want to uh, support the channel furthermore, that is the way you do it. So with that being said, I just wish you best of luck and please enjoy your monthly general tarot reading. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye. Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Rad Kutart and this is going to be Aquarius and Aquarius Moon and Aquarius Rising monthly tower reading for July 2018. So we got four position enhanced star spread guys and uh, first position expresses up the Aquarius' topic for that particular month. The second position expresses up the challenges that Aquarius needs to face due July. And then we have the third position that shows up the positivity July has to offer for Aquarius. And the last card or the last position, should I say, that will be the final outcome or the result of the previous three positions. And as this is an enhanced spread, we're going to use multiple cards per position or in our case, this is going to be two cards per position. So let's see what the first card for the general topic is that we do have. That will be the Queen of Cups with uh, the Ten of Cups. All right. <clears throat> So, uh, for what it seems, uh, this month for you Aquarius is going to be a month of um, emotional fulfillment, should I say. So, it does look like that um, uh, you will be quite well shielded from a, a negative situations, from um, <clears throat> negative people as well, and in general from troubles, and that shield will be from this woman over here most likely that plays a, a motherhood figurine in your life. The Ten of Cups next to it however does point that the time for obtaining uh, a little bit more independence as well has come. Now very important here is to recognize that the tenths are always kind of like a developing of uh, or kind of like finalizing a, a cycle of development. That being said <clears throat> When we do have these couple of cards as a topic here, it does speak that we need to become a little bit more independable, independable when we deal with our own personal stuff. But on top of that, we also need to take under consideration that when shit hit the, hits the fan, we can always have, we always do have someone to, that we can turn on to for help and for emotional support. You need to know that this is all about emotional support. But in the grand scheme of things, guys, uh, apart from this support of someone else who is a, um, a very loyal and very faithful, these cards also speak that during that month, things are gonna go rather very smoothly and very steady when it comes to career and relationship. And when we speak about relationship, it does look like that things are gonna go even greater because um, with the Ten of Cups in the Queen of Cups, it, it does look like that you will finally, you and your partner, in case you do have such, you will be able to express the full extent of your emotions. So if you, uh, for example, you have a f person of interest and you uh, really like them, but you don't find the guts, the courage or the appropriate time to tell that to them, for what it seems July is, July is going to present you with numerous opportunity to do so. But the bottom line here is, 
is that uh, I would just say it with that with that kind of a sentence, guys. But you following the uh, the feelings of your heart, you are going to find yourself transformed, and you are going to find that your life is even worth more living now than any time before. That for some reason. Now that reason will be dif uh, individual for every single one of us because this is a general reading, not a personal one. But in general, we are going to find that reason that will make us keep on going even more um, <clears throat> tenacious moving on forward, even even filled with a, a greater hopes for a, a brighter future. And then we do have the challenges your Aquarius is that you're going to face. That is going to be the Ten of Wands with the Four of Cups. So here now we do have a, a, a lot of um, responsibilities you have to take over. We're not talking just for one responsibility, but we're talking for a, a lot. Uh, regardless of that, it's going to be either for your career or for your relationship. It does look like that you will not have much of a free time for yourself. And those responsibilities as well and those tasks that you need to attend to, they will not be very interesting either. But in the same time, you're going to recognize in them because as a challenge, challenges always have a, a positive end. When you overcome a challenge you receive a reward that is what the challenge is you know and the reward of uh, of these um, responsibilities duties and tasks that comes one after another it seems that the hits doesn't stop coming you know when you th when you feel that you do have a room to breathe you know and to attend to your personal needs another one will come around but the bottom line is that some of these tasks are going to turn out as a, a very promising opportunities for your behalf. I, and uh, it is very important at that point to not, um, how can I place it, to not um, kind of think over think over it for a, a prolonged period of time because that particular opportunity needs to be seized immediately. So it is also about bravery here. We're talking about that you need to have so you can kind of like involve yourself, you know, with a little bit more different activity than you do have involved yourself until this very moment. Uh, it is very important here with the Ten of Swords, uh, with the Ten of Wands is to recognize that it is not about you and your needs when it comes to those challenges, guys. It is yeah, about the, the needs of others or the needs of those who are paying your bills, the needs of those who are um, signing your checks and the needs of those which you want to be with. So it's not about you here when it comes to those challenges. It is about those that you depend on. So be accountable for that. And then we do have the positivity that the moon has to offer for you. That will be the two of swords, which contributes directly to the situation that we do have with the queen of cups and the ten of cups with the um, <clears throat> ten of um, with the Ten of Pentacles. So what we do have here is that actually um, uh, this guy, this month deprives you from uh, facing a, a consequences of um, of your personal actions. And what I mean is that by you fulfilling the responsibilities toward other people, that means that the result of those responsibilities will be uh, will will be a responsibility of those people who gave you those responsibilities. If that makes any sense, all right. So that being said, guys, uh, in, in case something isn't working out very well, this isn't because you. This isn't because your um, lack of performance, etc., etc. Just on the the contrary here these cards are showing that your performance will be just enough all right maybe not exceptional but just enough now with the ten of with the ten of pentacles and with the two of swords also that gives you the opportunity to break the contract in any time as well all right so you need to be very mindful of that however with the two of swords it is it is uh, more beneficial to wait it out all right until the other side doesn't break the contract or does not kind of like relieve you from uh, relieve themselves from your services and that way you are not gonna as I said face any consequences and that way you are not going to um, <clears throat> have to deal with you know with uh, interests 
all right or with kind of like penalties and because it falls into a, a positive positions it means that those noxious and hurtful rather like a negative contracts or obligations that you may have either toward people in your social circle or in, in career wise etc etc those which are kind of like there to harm you they will start start dropping off so these people who are walking away from your life actually they don't contribute for your greater good here so it's going to be like a clearance here and 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 probably it is why you're going to feel that emotional uh, emotional relief during the month and you are going to start feel that uh, the life is start worth living once again all right so it's it's a month where uh, you can face it with a little bit grief if you are a very sensitive person Aquarius because as I said there will be a people who will leave your life all right but uh, when you draw the line you will see that actually it is better that way and then we do have the final outcome or the results of all that and this is the Sun card with the page of wands so the sun card guys promises you great things the sun card it is one of the most cheerful cards in the tarot deck the sun card points that are uh, you will be contributed or rather like something will contribute for your happiness all right and in addition to the page of wands it does speaks that this is going to be a brand new enterprise for you that is going to make a, a current <clears throat> disagreements with your co-workers or with your friends to be simply put aside it will um, <clears throat> it will also encourage you to move on forward these cards are pointing that your situations that you are involving yourself in also are going to be resolved Resolved totally naturally which means that you will not have to struggle all right so the struggling will be over at the end of the month and you will successfully fulfill the challenges here which is very important and as the challenges we said that these are going to be tasks and responsibilities either career wise and either relationship wise and as we said that those challenges are going to give you new opportunities it is exactly what we do have here with the page of wands because the page of wands promises new beginnings uh, however when we do have the page of wands we need to be brave enough to face everything new we should not pull our, ourselves back from it and as well having the sun card here in in a contribution it means that you totally totally deserve it all right so it didn't happen because you just sit on your butt and you wait it out but it happened because you actually have the skills the knowledge or the position to take it not to mention that the sun card also promises monetary success so if it is about career that may speak for a promotion or a raise all right based on a a new position you will be assigned all right or a new project that you will be assigned and also speak for a, a vigor and a very passionate time into one relationship or interactions with a, a person of interest and you are going to find yourself much more free when those people here who are actually only um you know uh, kind of like filling up your time with uh, with the necessary goals and tasks that serves you no favor are no longer in the picture. So with that being said, Aquarius, this was your monthly tarot reading July 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you are interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.